Today's game is coming to you from Qualcomm Stadium, home of the San Diego Chargers. Welcome to a game featuring two teams from the AFC. San Diego matches up against Houston. The teams have taken the field. We're ready for the kickoff. Kelly is back and ready to put this one in the air. He got all of it. The Chargers will start the drive from the 20-yard line. John, if I say defense wins championships, the cliche police will arrest me, but I'm going to say it anyway as two of the very best are out there for this one. First and these are the games that I really love to watch. It's all about ball control and limiting the mistakes that you make on offense. Both of these teams have a ton of talent on the defensive side, and I'll tell you one thing for sure. It's going to be tough to score points in this one. Well, it'll be a dogfight right down to the end. This is a spot where you want to show the defense that they have to respect the running game. Picked up about six yards that time. Ball on their own 25. Ball on the 25 yard line. Let's go! Deuce it, deuce it. With a counter play. He's brought down behind the line for a short loss. The defense made that play stretch further than the runner wanted to make it. Third and five. Ball on the 25 yard line. Do something, do something. No stop, no stop that motor. Langer will work out of the shotgun. Drops back with the pass. Buckley comes up to make the play. This is good communication between the quarterback and his receiver to keep the chains moving. They know where the first down marker is, and they recognize the type of coverage the defense is playing. The ball is there, and so is the catch. Right now, they need to keep going at the defense with a run. Sooner or later, they'll be able to break one for a big game. Second and eight. Ball on the 36-yard line. You can't stop me. Number 39 lines up behind his fullback in the eye. It'll be third down after they fail to complete that short attempt. Third and eight. Ball on the 36-yard line. Give it under me. Contain him. It's on. Under pressure. Hit and set. Stroud did a great job breaking through, getting there for the set. Yeah, it's a great play because he had to slip the blocker, then use his speed to get back to it. And he just made it look simple. Mitchell is ready to punt this one away. Number 85 will go back to accept this punt. And he signals for the fair catch. Fair catch made at the 38 yard line. The Ball Texans on their own 38. Start the drive at the 38 yard line. First and 10. Out of the eye formation. On the ground. Setting up play action. Gets rid of it. The 40. The wide receiver has it. The 30. Jammer is there on the stop at the 17 yard line. Watch this. When you talk about not giving up on a play, having a motor that's always running, this is it right here. He gets a good shot at him and misses. But he comes back and he still ends up making the tackle. Yeah, you see me. Here we go. Great shoot. 
Haley goes in motion. Cross play to the right. Ingram comes up to make the play at the 17. Straight. He's able to get a yard or two on the toss. They're inside the 20. Ball on the 17 yard line. Watch him there. Let's go. Let's go. Here we go. Come on. Not today. They soft, man. Hand it off. Sanders is there for the tackle at the 12 yard line. Strager rumbles forward for a gain of four. The seven yard line is where they have to go on this third down play. They line up at the I formation. Morrison comes up to make the play at the seven. Good pick up on the ground as they convert for the first. Here's the thing. They were looking run and brought the blitz. But the back just used his vision and elusiveness to avoid him and get past tomorrow. It's first and goal at the seven yard line. Only the counter play. Citron is there for the tackle at the seven. One yard. First and goal. They can't get into the end zone. It's second and goal at the seven yard line. Nothing. They don't get nothing. The Chargers come out in a four three. Keep moving. Looking for room. Sanders comes up to make the play. At the one. Didn't get the blocking they needed, and now it'll be third down and goal. It's third and goal at the one-yard line. Stringer, the deep back. With a counter play. Touchdown. Touchdown. Run it in on third down. Comes in for the extra point. The extra point attempt is good. Perfect way to start this one off as they move the ball down the field for the touchdown. They came out with a plan on offense and executed it to perfection. Kelly in to kick this one off. This one is taken by Lindsay. You know that the offense has their eyes set on tying this thing up here on this drive. We'll have to see what they're able to put together. The ball on their own 20. Start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Toss play to the right. Drop in the backfield for a short You know, Johnny always seems to be in perfect position to make a play. He's all about effort. His motor's always running at 100%, and he's got the experience to diagnose plays very quickly. Second it's second down and a long way to go. On the 18 yard line. Orlando comes up to make the play at the 18-yard line. When you run the ball in the first half, you're trying to keep the defense honest. But if you're only getting gains like that in the second half, then it puts more pressure on your passing game. And they'll face a long third down here. They worry about us coming. Houston comes out in their nickel package. Drops back. With the throw. 
Right on target to the wide receiver. A 15-yard gain right there on third down. Nickel back in this time. Drives the left side. Number 94 is there on the stop at the 49. Just a fabulous run there, John. What makes him a special runner is the ability to avoid hands and arms so well. It's like he knows just what to do at the very second he needs to do it. It's first and ten. Only one man in the backfield. Pressure coming. Gets pulled down from behind. Great play to knife in there for the sack. Clearly, the offensive line is having a lot of trouble getting it together. You have to be able to protect the quarterback in that type of situation. It's going to take a little longer to find the open man or the hole in the zone. And you've got to find a way to give him that extra time that he needs. Play two quarters, two quarters. Out of the gun. Dropping back with the throw. Almost picked off. Number 86 was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Buxley was there on the coverage. Third and 15. Ball on the 43 yard line. They'll go from the shotgun. White comes in motion. Fakes the throw. Going for the deep man. This pass is incomplete. He has a great arm, but that pass was just a little bit too long. They really like the way he throws a deep passes. He can make all the throws. The short ones, the medium ones, the long ones. This guy can do it all. Now, he'll struggle with his consistency every now and then. But they sure could do a heck of a lot worse at this quarterback position. Number 85 lines up deep for the punt return. And so the punt goes out of bounds. First, First and ten. Ball on the 33 yard line. The Chargers come out in a 4 3. Direction. Dutton is there on the stop at the 34. So after that run, we can see how the two main threats on the ground have fared so far. Ball on their own 34. One back. Come on. It off to the back. Sanders is there for the tackle. Running the ball consistently is the first step in creating a balanced attack. Ball on their own 39. Ball on the 39 yard line. The Chargers line up in a 4 3. Nice play fake. Wide receiver has it, and he's knocked out of bounds at the 34-yard line. He's done an excellent job of getting open and making catches. The defense better start paying a little more attention to this guy, or he's really going to burn him before this is over. So after that nice catch and run, here's a look at his stats. The Chargers come out in a 4-3. Play to the left. Gathers is there on the stop. This is one of those games where you just keep running it at him. Four yards here, five yards there, and loosen them up, and then wham! You knock them out late in the game with that long touchdown run. Ball on the 30-yard line. Ball on the 30-yard line. Here we go. Johnson, the motion man. Tosses it out to the right. 
Ingram comes up to make the play at the 33. Nothing doing there as the linebacker read the play and throws him for a big loss. That was a heck of a play. He has great speed and he uses it to fly through the line and take down the ball carrier. And we're ready to start in the second quarter. Third down, and they'll have to try to get it to the 24-yard line to pick up a first down. Hamilton out of the gun. Throwing. And this pass is complete. Robinson is there for the tackle at the 17. Nice call going to the air, and that'll move the chain. They're in the red zone. Ball on the 17-yard line. On the 10, 10. The last time they were inside the 20, they got a touchdown out of it. Ingram is there on the stop at the 16. Stringer takes it up the middle for a yard or two. Eighth play of this drive. Ball on the 16-yard line. The Chargers with a four-man front. Hands it off to the back. Great fake. Goes to the end zone. Nearly intercepted. And this is an incredible play by the defender. You know, he didn't look like he would be there in time. But he jumped over the top of everyone, and he got his hand on it to knock it away. Gets the pass off, and he can't find a way to keep possession. Despite excellent hands and a pass right on target, the receiver can't bring it in. He's a trusted possession receiver who the quarterback looks for whenever he needs a big catch. This time, he dropped it. But I'm guessing that they'll continue to look in his direction when they need that big play. Brown leads the field goal team into the game for the attempt. The, field goal the veteran connecting for the field goal. And give credit to the kicker there. It's nice to have a guy that can make your drive worth three, even if you don't get it in the end zone every time. Kelly looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. He got all of that one. This one is handled by Lindsay. The offense takes over after they were unable to get any points on their last drive. The Chargers will start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Running to the left side. Can't bring him down. Number 58 is there on the stop at the 22. So let's take a look at how this back compares to the opposition. Second and eight. Ball on the 22-yard line. Will, Will, Will. Hey, watch that screen. Number 39, the long back. They'll go with a play fake. It's complete. He puts something extra on that throw, and that'll keep the chains moving. And that's what it takes sometimes, because defenders are so quick that one millisecond can make a difference. First and ten. Ball on the 32-yard line. Hands it off. He's brought down behind the line for a short loss. Big tackle there for a loss, and great pursuit there, John. You can say that again. He knows how to prepare, and it really pays off when you make stops like that. Ball on their own 32. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, D, let's go. Out of the eye formation. Pressure, throws it. Number 55 comes up to make the play at the 25. Watch this. He stands him up, and he puts him right down. That's stopping in your tracks right there.
It's showtime, baby. Stay focused, DB. Stay deeper than deeper. Looking for the long completion. Almost intercepted. That was a good play, turned bad play. Good because their zone defense worked well. Bad because he dropped the interception. That's one he wishes he could have back. Number 85. Looks like he's ready for the return. From the 36-yard line. 37-yard line. Return for the gain of three yards. The ball on their own 40. Start the drive at the 40-yard line. First and 10. The Chargers come out of the nickel package. Throws it. He finds his man. Ingram comes up Johnson to make the play the at the 43-yard line. The Any first down play needs to yield some kind of yardage. You don't want second and long too many times. Second and seven. Ball on the 43-yard line. Will, Will, Will. Let's go. Set. Only one man back. All right, now. Stay both now. We're talking about Reed. A little misdirection. Perry is there for the tackle at the 44-yard line. He brought some extra people but couldn't stop him before he got the first. And run blitzing these guys isn't a bad idea because you know they like to run. you got to be sure to bring guys in the right play. If you think they might run to the outside, additional blitzers in the middle isn't going to help you much. Stringer, the lone back. With the pass, target, and he gets it. Excellent recognition by the receiver, reading the coverage and adjusting his route accordingly. Option routes are receiving routes designed to take advantage of the coverage. It's up to both the receiver and the quarterback to make the same read. If the receiver reads zone, but the quarterback reads man, you can see passes going right to defender. The Chargers come out in a 4 3. Let's go, boys! Let's go! On the call, great fake with the throw. Robinson comes up to make the play at the nine-yard line. They throw it and pick up a second consecutive first down. Well, when you start to establish something, you want to keep it going until the defense finds a way to stop you. It's first and goal at the nine. Hey, watch the ball. They kicked the field goal the last time they were in the red zone. Under pressure, gets rid of it. He didn't want to risk an interception and decides to throw it away. Second nine yards, goal. they'll be in the end zone. Ball on the nine yard line. Hey, watch the screen. Look, look. Set. Haley, the motion man. Looks to the end zone. In Incomplete pass. pass. Try to get it in for six. Put on the third down. Third it's third and goal at the nine-yard line. There we go, baby. Rock and roll. Defense get ready. So we're going to take it. Pressure coming. Rosen drops the interception. Got away with that bad throw on third down, John. The defender did a great job of breaking up the touchdown. But still, he should have had himself a pick. So this should be an easy throw. The kick sails through. It's good. They get three more to go up by 13.
Kelly will be kicking off. This one is taken by Lindsay. If they want to make this a game, they have to buckle down, avoid mistakes, and work hard to dig themselves out of this hole. The ball on their own 20. Start the drive at the 20-yard line. First and 10. The Chargers line up in trips bunch. With a counter play, spins away from the tackle. Orlando comes up to make the play at the 24-yard line. And now our viewers can see how successful each team's main running threat has been today. Second and six. Ball on the 24-yard line. Drops back. Looking deep to the right. Ooh, nearly picked off. What the defense is doing is they're watching the quarterback's eyes. They're pulling. They're in position so that whatever happens, the ball is in front of them. And that time, it almost got him an interception. Third and six. Ball on the 24-yard line. Closing in. They need some better blocking out of that offensive front. You have to use your hands, get them out in front of you, keep them inside, maintain leverage, and balance it. You need to hold those blocks and slow down the pass rush. So they line up the punt after going three and out. He signals for a fair catch. Fair catch made at the 42-yard line. The Almost at the two-minute mark the now. Drive at the 42-yard line. First and ten. They stop, man. They stop. They stop. They stop. They stop. With a counter play, the defender goes down. Dropped in the backfield for a short loss. Trying to find some room in the middle, but there was no place to go. He brought some extra guys up on the run blitz. They got penetration, and they shut the play down. Two-minute warning coming up. Ball on the 40-yard line. Bring it up, bring it up. Out of the gun. Stepping up, throwing. He's made. That was a good adjustment by the receiver as he reads the man coverage and finds open space. The thing with these option routes is everyone has to make their read quickly and make their adjustments quickly. Running option routes and running them effectively takes a lot of repetition and practice. The Chargers come out in a 4-3. Pass play here on first down. Gets rid of it. Robinson comes up to make the play at the 31. Brian Johnson had a good week of practice, and we're seeing the results here. Second and four coming up here. Stringer, the lone back, going to the right. Ingram is there on the stop at the 33-yard line. Well, you know what they say, the quickest way to the end zone is straight ahead. Going to the outside isn't always the best way to pick up yardage. Running the ball right at the defense can be a very effective strategy. The 27-yard line is the spot they'll have to get it to to convert on this third down play. Only one man in the backfield. Nice play fake. Rosen, the 10. Touchdown, Texans. When you get this kind of execution, you got a great chance of making a big play. Watch it here as everyone takes care of their assignment. The pass is thrown where the receiver can make the best play in the ball. And it's six points. The point after is good. That touchdown now, John, puts them up by three scores, and we're not even at the half. They're a scoring machine. 
The coaches are calling the right plays against the defense, and the players are executing perfectly. Kelly comes in to kick off. This one is fielded by Lindsay. The Chargers need to rebound quickly as they start this drive at the 20. The Chargers will start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. The Texans come out of the nickel pack. Gets rid of it. Gets his hand on it. He needs to do a better job putting the pass in a spot where only his guy can get it. Those tip passes can turn into interceptions pretty easily. Parker was the intended receiver on that play. Second and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. Not today. Check it. Yeah, you see me. Dropping back. Looking long down the right side of the field. Incomplete pass. Great effort up front to put the pressure on. And you see that kind of thing out of these guys a lot. They're big and they're strong and they're fast. Opposing offensive lines sure have their hands full when they get out in this field. Third and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. Stay focused, DB. Turn over, turn over, turn over. The Texan come out of the nickel pack. Pressure with the throw. He hits his receiver. That blitz exploited for a first down. Yeah, the quarterback did a heck of a job to read what the defense was doing and find the right guy. I like to hurry up here. It's a change of pace, and it's a way to get the defense uncomfortable. We're guessing they're going to just throw it and do their best to move into scoring range since they don't want to go into the half with the score the way it is. A little over a minute left. Number 39, the lone there, setback. There. Me going. Under pressure, gets rid of it. They dropped additional people into the secondary, but still generated an excellent pass rush. And that gives you a lot of flexibility calling your defense. If the guys up front are good at creating pressure, then you don't have to blitz as often, giving you the ability to double cover an opponent's best receiver. Out of the shotgun. Pressure coming with the pass. And the catch is made. Buckley is there for the tackle at the 40-yard line. They got to have good clock management if they want to get some points in this drive. And if they can get some, it will be a big help for them going into half. The Texans come out of the nickel pack with the throw. Almost picked off. Branch had his hands on it. I think he was invisible out there. Wasn't even seen. And that's a break for the offense. Second and ten. Ball on the 40-yard line. Everything you got. Houston comes out in their nickel packet. Rowing. Buckley is there on the stop at the 30. What they're doing here is keeping the defense from huddling up. And it keeps the same defense on the field. Lindsay moves in motion. Drops back with the pass. And he lets it slip out of his grasp. San Diego comes up short on third down again. score of the day. The, the try is good. is good. He's one of those guys who really works hard at what he does. And you can see that hard work paying off when you make a kick like this one.
This one is fielded by number 85. They've really taken control of this thing as they head back out on offense. The defensive coordinator was going over some things with his guys on the sideline. Maybe they made some adjustments that are going to slow them down. Houston Home on their own 20. The drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Hey, watch the screen. Let's go now. Throwing. This one falls incomplete. A little bit long, overthrowing the receivers. That might have had something to do with his follow through. If you release the pass just a little late, you're going to see underthrows or balls thrown into the ground. If you release it too early, then you'll see an overthrow Ball like that. Let's go, be physical. Play football. The Chargers come out in a dime pack. Throws it. Right on target to the wide receiver. Wayne, that powerful arm brings him a first down this time. Yeah, and you talk about putting some heat on your throws. This guy really let it go. First One of the ten. stats that I always look for in receivers Ball is rap. That's the yards that are earned after the catch. And that really depends on the receiver's speed and his ability to make people miss. This guy's been making a miss all day. So after the first two quarters of play, the score is 20 to 3. Texans. We're ready to begin the quarter of play. Mitchell looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. This one is handled by number 85. The most important thing to do now is to protect the football. You've got a good lead, and you don't want to throw it away by making any costly mistakes. Ball on their own 20. The Chargers come out in a 4-3. Looks like somebody got off the line Step a little early here. That start on the offense. Number 31. Johnson Still moved down. a little early there. Yeah, the rule for the offensive line is once you put your hand down, you can't move until the ball snaps. So after the penalty, it's now first and 15. They'll pass on first down. Gets rid of it, right on target to the wide receiver. Wayne, With that completion, he's now over 200 two, yards past. Second, Second and 13. long. Ball on the 17-yard line. The Texans line up in trips bunch. Defense, get ready. Drops back. Real, real, real. Closing in, gets the pass off. Robinson Wayne, is there the for the tackle. At the 19. This is where the defense needs to hold. They've done a good job to get him in this situation. Just about a three-yard game. Ball on their own 19. Ball on the 19-yard line. Stringer, the lone back. It's a blitz. Puts everything behind this one. Knocked away. Good defense and three and out series are the way to keep your defense fresh and rested. Nothing happening on that drive, and they'll punt it away. This one goes out of bounds. First, First and ten. ten. Ball on the 48-yard line. They ain't got nothing. Keep the throttle down. And right for the tailback. Number 94 comes up to make the play at the 45. Now let's have a look at what our runners have done up to this point. Second and seven. Ball on the 45-yard line. 
The Texans come out in a nickel package. Rowing. It's batted away. Plenty of pressure, and he barely gets the pass away. This defensive coordinator understands that pressure is the key to forcing the offense into making mistakes. If his players keep playing like this, he might be up for a head coaching job pretty soon. Third and here's seven. what they've been able to do Ball so far on third down. Hey, let's go one deep. Bring it up, bring it up. Nickelback in this time. Rosen. Harmon is there on the stop. Langer is right on the mark with that throw. Third down is when you really need your quarterback to be sharp because the temptation to force something in is bigger. That time he found the right guy and he made a good throw. First and ten. Ball on the 38 yard line. Hey, watch the ball. They line up in the I formation. White, the motion man. They'll bring the blitz. Rowing. Lead of pass to the back. The defense blitzes the corner, but the quarterback got rid of it quickly for a completion and a first down. That was a great play because he saw him coming, remained calm, and threw an accurate pass. First Ball on the 25-yard line. Ball on the 25-yard line. Let's go. Pass play here on first down with the pass. Pass caught by the fullback. Langer completes that one, and it goes for about four yards. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 21-yard line. Throws it. He can't stay inbounds. They like to throw it to the sidelines in situations like that. His throw was just a little off. White was his intended target. Third and six. Ball on the 21 yard line. Stay back, stop. The Texans come out in a nickel pack. Hand it off to the back. McFadden is there on the stop at the 18. They can't get the first down, but they're in field goal range. Phil Dawson comes in for what will be a 35-yard field goal attempt. It's good. A good start to the second half, engineering a drive that ends with a field goal. That's a real good way to get momentum going in your favor. Mitchell in to kick this one off. Booming kick downfield. This one is taken by number 85. Let's see if this possession is more effective after their last possession ended in a punt. First and 10. Ball on the 20 yard line. The Chargers come out in a nickel package. Hey, let's go. Not today. We're talking about three. Hey, Going to the air on first down. Pressure throws on the run. He can't bring it down inbounds. I think the quarterback just let that one get away. Johnson was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Second and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. The Chargers line up in a 4 3. Rosen, incomplete pass. And good pressure forced him to get rid of the pass early. Any way you look at it, an incomplete pass is a heck of a lot better than throwing it to the other guy. Third and 10. Ball on the 20 yard line. The Chargers line up in the quarter defense. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. Dropping back. Gets rid of it. 
Right on target to the wide receiver. That kind of thing always makes me shake my head. What was the guy thinking? A short pass reception like that will never get you the yardage you need to move past the first down marker. Good defensive stand there. Now they'll punt it away after a three and out. Andy waves for the fair catch. Been a rough start to this game, but they still have enough time to turn it around. The ball on their own 33. Start the drive at the 33 yard line. First and 10. They'll go from the I formation. Gets the pass off. With the adjustment, he has it. Grant is there on the stop. Pass the 44. Great throw to beat the zone. I'll tell you, the defense has to do a better job of coming up and clamping down on the receiver whenever he enters their zone. Ball on their own 44. Ball on the 44 yard. Off to the fullback. They go in to spot this one at the 49. Solid game. Picks up another tackle. The best backs in the league average four to five yards a carry. But there are a lot of things that go into a successful running game. You got to have good play calling, good blocking up front, and a back that can take advantage when he sees the opening. So that's a gain of about five. Here we come. All day, baby. Come on. Here comes the blitz. Going deep. John, he rushed that throw. And you should credit the defensive lines. They do a nice job tying up the blockers and can bring pressure up the middle. When you combine their play with the fact that the defensive coordinator likes to bring additional blitzers from the outside, it can make for a very long day for the quarterback. Everything you got, check it. Let's go. Number 39 lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Pass rolls incomplete. San Diego fails once again to get the first down, and that's seven times. Yeah, and that's huge for the defense to keep stepping up on third down like that. They're a solid group of guys who make key stops. Mitchell comes into the game for the punt. Number 85, into return. Won't take a chance trying to return this one. Fair catch made at the 11 yard line. They'll First and 10. At the 11 yard line. First and 10. Let's go now. The Chargers line up in a 4 3. Throwing. He finds his man. This one will be spotted at the 48-yard line. The tackle is his fifth of the game. He's over the century mark in yardage with that last reception. Ball on their own 48. Ball on the 48-yard line. The Chargers with a four-man front. Pass play here on first down with the pass. It's batted away. A short pass, falling to the turf, and it'll be second down. Receiver on the play. Second and ten. Ball on the 48-yard line. Yeah, you see me. Let's go, be good. The Chargers come out in a dime packet. Gets rid of it. Jammer is there on the Wayne. stop. With the Reggie Wayne told us before the game he thought he'd have a big day, and he's proven it. That's seven catches thus far. Looking to convert on third down, they have to get it to the 42. The Chargers with a four man front. Let's go. Throws it. Robinson makes the play at the 27-yard line. He's had a nice day moving the ball through the air. Over 250 yards passing.
Ball on the 27 yard line. From the start, from the start. The Chargers line up in a 4 3. Play hard and fast, baby. With the carry, play action. Gets rid of it. Incomplete pass. Obviously not what he was looking for. Second and ten. Ball on the 27 yard line. Stringer, the deep man. Hamilton with a man in motion. Going to the left. Dutton is the guy who's there to bring him down at the 25-yard line. The defense held their positions and didn't let him get very far. The 17-yard line is where they have to go for a first. The Chargers come out in a nickel package. Looking upfield. They're going to spot this one at the 16. So that tackle now gives him four. They get it again on third down. That's the kind of thing that deflates a defense. They keep getting them in these third down situations. And they can't seem to get the offense off the field. And this is the eighth play of this drive. They're inside the 20. Last time they were down here, they settled for a field goal. Keep the throttle down. Hands it off to the back. Misses the tackle. Morrison is there for the tackle at the two. It's another running play, and they'll pick up another first down. Hey, when things are clicking like this, you just want to keep going for as long as you can. First it's first and goal, and goal at the two-yard two line. Hey, let's go. Watch your eyes. Out of the eye formation. Hamilton sends a man in motion. Looking for the goal line. And no score. Touchdown. Now this is exactly how to get the ball in the end zone. Just get in behind the center and guard and keep pushing and pushing until they're putting up six points in the board. The point after is good. Now that's just the type of thing that you come to expect from these guys. They do a really good job scripting the plays that they're going to be running. And they do a great job of executing them when they run them. Kelly is back and ready to put this one in the air. Nice kick. Plenty of distance. This one is fielded by Lindsay. The Chargers face an uphill battle as they begin this drive. At the 20. The Chargers will start the drive at the 20-yard line. First and 10. Number 39 lines up behind his fullback in the eye. They give it to the halfback. Harmon comes up to make the play. When your offensive line is getting a good push up front, it's a lot easier to pick up yardage on the ground. Second and two. Ball on the 28 yard line. All right, now. I can do it, baby. Here we go. Under pressure, fires this one deep. He's there for the catch. He throws it in double coverage, but they come away with the first down. First and ten. We've completed three quarters of play, and the score is 27 to 6. Texans. San Diego needs to play a perfect fourth quarter 
if they're going to make a game here. First so they have first and ten here. Here we come. We're talking about Bree. Out of the eye formation. Brown comes in motion. What's the hard count? Hand it off. Ogunwaye is there on the stop at the 34. Play calling is very surprising considering the size of the deficit. This is not a good time to sneak in a running play. They need lots of yards real fast. Second and four. Ball on the 34 yard line. Yeah, so let's go. Hey, watch the the Texans come out in a dime package. Gets rid of it. He finds his man. Hamilton is there for the tackle. Perfect execution to get this first down. Look at it here. He knows how far they have to move the chain. And he gets it by making the right decision and laying it in there like that. The 10. Touchdown, Chargers. Touchdown, San Diego. John, he clearly should have been taken down behind the line of scrimmage, but they missed, and he ends up in the end zone. You just can't let that happen and expect to win game. You've got to have sound tackling. So many players go for the knockout punch, but I'm telling you, it doesn't work on most runners. Dawson comes in to attempt the point after. The point after is good. The Chargers have just made it a two-score game. This team can put up some points, but this might be a little too deep a hole. Mitchell comes in to kick off. Good distance. This one is handled by number 85. It's first and ten. Start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and ten. With a counter play, Morrison comes up to make the play at the 22. Stringer runs it for about three on the counter play. Second and eight. Ball on the 22 yard line. Are we, are we? The Chargers line up in a 4 3. I'm coming through, baby. Looking to run it here. Ingram is there on the stop at the 29. Stringer kept his legs moving, gets seven hard earned yards. Third and maybe one. Keep the throttle down. The defense has had difficulty stopping them on third down. Hey, let's go. Going for the first on short yardage. Gets rid of it. This pass is incomplete. When you talk about ball control and time of possession, that's not what you want to see. So three and out, and they'll line up to punt. Fair catch called for. Fair if they want a shot in this one, they got to put something together on this drive. There just isn't much time left. Ball on their own 28. Will start the drive at the 28-yard line. First and ten. Number 39 lines up behind his fullback in the eye. This 
one will be spotted at the 40. He makes his fifth stop of the game on that play. Hey, if you can keep running the ball in the fourth quarter as you're playing catch-up, that's an advantage that you have over the defense because it keeps them off balance. Doesn't get much behind it. The defenders got it. The 30, the 20, the 10. Touchdown, Texans. Exactly what they had to do. Force the bad throw, get the takeaway, return it for the score. Brown comes in for the extra point. The point after is good. Kelly looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. That one is out of the end zone. They need one quick score and then some more. The Texans come out in a nickel package. To a play, can't bring him down. Buckley is there on the stop at the 39-yard line. Some of these guys are like a train. They lower their head, keep their legs moving, and charge it straight ahead. Sometimes he'll even drag a defender 10 yards before he'll start slowing down. up the ball carrier and his tackle total is now four. Second, Second and long. Ball on the 37 yard line. Keep moving. Danny, Danny, Danny. Langer out of the gun. With the pass. Interception. He always knows where to be, and that time he's rewarded with the interception. And he does an excellent job of reading where the quarterback wants to throw the ball. He'll anticipate the throw and then make the perfect play on it. First Following ten, the interception, it's now the first and ten. Line. Hey, watch that screen! The Chargers with a four-man front. Throws it. Have a look at this big defensive lineman. He couldn't get to the quarterback, so he got his hands up and he knocked it down. Let us dictate. All on us, y'all. Throwing. And this pass is completed. He picks up more yardage with that completion and now has almost thrown for 300 yards. Chargers come out in a 4 3. They got nothing. Give it to the halfback. What a stiff one. 
Perry comes up to make the play. Stringer handles his way forward for what appears to be a two-yard pick. Ball on the 23-yard line. Ball on the 23-yard line. Hey, let's go. The Chargers with a four-man front. With the throw, it's broken up. He has to do a better job of looking off the coverage before he makes a throw like that. Number 88 was the intended receiver on that play. Third and eight. Ball on the 23-yard line. Contain him! These third downs haven't been much of an obstacle, and it's helped them to take the lead. Gets the toss to the right. Off and run. The 10. Touchdown. Touchdown. Stringer gets the handoff, breaks the plane for the second time. comes in to attempt the point after. The extra, extra point, point attempt, attempt is good. good. The Texans have it all working now as they continue to expand their lead. Kelly is back and ready to put this one in the air. Nice distance. This one is fielded by Lindsay. This is one of those situations where they're playing for respect. The game really hasn't gone the way they thought it would, but they have a lot of pride in their team. And I'd expect to see them keep fighting till that final whistle. San Diego will start the drive at the 20-yard line. First and 10. Watch the screen. Watch each other back. Tosses it right. Orlando is there on the stop. That was a lack of execution from the offense. When the plan is to take it to the outside around the corner, you need to pick up some key blocks. It's second down and 10 to go. All right, now. Keep moving. Nickelback in this time. Pressure coming. Throws it. This pass is incomplete. Good push by the defensive line, forcing the incomplete pass. He hung in there. He didn't really have the time that he needed to make the play. The quarterback has to know who his outlet guy is and get the ball to him when he feels that pressure coming. Here's a look at the third down success rate of each team. Keep the throttle down. They'll go from the shotgun. Langer sends a man in motion. Dropping back. Gets rid of it. It's going the other way. Make Big mistake by the interception. So here's how each team has done protecting the ball or lack thereof, perhaps. So they're ready to go on offense Ball after on the, the interception. They'll line. start at the 30. Let's go, boys. The Chargers with a four-man front. Hamilton with a man in motion. Aimed it off to the back. Dutton is there on the stop at the 23-yard line. Stringer runs it through the middle of the game of about six. Second, Second and four, four coming up here. On the 23 yard. There we go. Let's go. 
The Chargers come out in a 4-3. They give it to the halfback. Ingram is there for the tackle at the 19-yard line. Excellent run for a first down. They brought some extra heat with a blitz, but he was able to find some room and pick up the first. first They're inside the 20. Ball on the 19-yard line. Let's go now. The Chargers line up in a 4-3. The blitz is on. Wide receiver has it. We're going to spot this one at the three. He stopped him there, and according to our numbers, that's tackle number six for him. There's three yards away from scoring. Everything you've got. What's free? Can he get there? Walk lob to the end zone. Touchdown, Texans. And here's what happened. The one thing that makes this play work is a fake to the back. And then with that, it gets a receiver that half step he needs to make the catch. The extra point attempt is good. The Texans continue to increase their lead. Kelly will be kicking off. He got all of it, and it sails out of the end zone. It sure doesn't look like they're going to be able to come back in this one. But it's an issue of pride. They want to prove that they're better than they've played so far. Two-minute warning coming up. Hey, let's go one deep. Let's go. Throws it. Knocked away. And that's just the kind of play they've come to expect from him. He always seems to make the big play just when they need him to. White was his intended target. It's almost at the two minute mark now. They come out in a dime package. All right, all right. Gets the pass off, and it's intercepted. Can't bring him down. The 20. So he throws the fourth quarter interception. He just should have tucked it away and run with it. First After the interception, they'll set up shot at the 13. Block, block, block. Here we go, baby. The Chargers come out in a nickel pack. Crosses it out to the right. Drops in the backfield for a short loss. They were trying to stretch the defense, trying to beat them to the sideline. But they have a quick defense, so it reacts very quickly to play. And they were right there to shut it down. Two minutes left. Ball on the 16-yard line. Stringer, the lone back. Hey, watch the ball. On the team, team. Come on. Here comes the blitz with the throw. With the adjustment, he has it. Well, he might have rushed that pass a little bit, but he's happy with the result. Yeah, I'd say. The defense was blitzing, so he knew that he had to get it out of there pretty quickly. And he did that connecting with his man for a pretty good pickup. They're 12 yards away from the end zone. We turn it up. The Chargers with a four-man front. And off to the tailback. Citron is there for the tackle. At the eight. Fourth down upcoming, but they're in position to add to their lead. Yeah, and that's what they wanted to do. Control the ball and the clock while getting into position.
had at least three points. Brown looking to make a good kick here. The Texans pour it on with another score. Kelly in to kick this one off. Won't have a chance for a return here. The Chargers will start the drive from the 20. First and 10. Ball on the 20 yard line. From the start, from the start. Let's go now. Bring it up, bring it up. Dropping back to pass on first down. Throws it. The pass is picked off. Not a wise decision to throw that ball. The offense gets ready to go following the interception. Let's run, man. Stringer in the backfield. Hands it off to the back. Sanders comes up to make the play at the 14. He's one of those guys who can put up 100 yards week in and week out. This has been just another day at the office for him. Second and four. Ball on the 14 yard line. I can do it, baby. Set. Hey, watch that screen. Hut, hut, hut. Hands it off. This one will be spotted at the 10. The offensive line loves to run block, playing physically against the defensive line. They've done a heck of a job of it out there today. So, a third down, they'll be looking for a play that will get them to the 10. Give it to the halfback. Perry is there on the stop. At the two. Great run there. That'll be a first down. He really ran well there. He gets some great blocks, and he has patience as he picks up the first down. It's first and goal at the two-yard line. Keep the throttle down. Is there for the tackle. Second it's second and goal, goal at the one yard line. Here we go, baby. Go <laughs> Looking for the goal line. Touchdown, Texans. I'll tell you, they just knocked that defensive line backwards on that play. Watch it here. The offensive line explodes off the ball. The defense can't get any penetration, and the runner is in the end zone.
Kelly is back and ready to put this one in the air. This one is taken by Lindsay. The Chargers will start the drive from the 20. Langer will work out of the shotgun, going to the air on first down. Gets rid of it, and he lets it slip out of his grasp. Such is back in there after getting taken out with an injury earlier. Langer starts out of the shotgun. Lindsay, the motion man. Here we go, baby, rock and roll. Hey, let's go. Drops back, gets the pass off. The wide receiver has it. The receiver with a lot of open room. The 30, the 20, the 10. Touchdown, Chargers. Dawson comes in for the extra point. The point after is good. Not much of a contest. One team pouring it on for a big margin of victory. This game is presented by the authority of the National Football League and EA Sports. Any publication, rebroadcast, or other use of the descriptions and accounts of this game without the expressed written permission of EA Sports is prohibited. This is Al Michaels. Good night.